Hey guys, what's up? In this video, we will be taking a quick overview of the new specialist, Camila Blasco, who has been introduced in Battlefield 2042's new Season 4, 11th Hour. Not only that, but I will also be providing you with some useful tips to help you get the most out of your gameplay with her. So sit back, relax, and enjoy! Camila Blasco is a recon specialist with two passive abilities that make her an excellent choice for players who enjoy a stealthy playstyle. Her first ability is that she cannot trigger motion sensors like TUGS or proxy sensors, making her invisible to the enemy team on the minimap if spotted by one of those. Additionally, enemy sentry turrets find it harder to get a lock on her. Blasco's specialist gadget is the X6 infiltration device. This device is stationary and can be set up like any other recon gadget such as spawn beacons or TUGS. It has a relatively long cooldown of 1 minute after being destroyed. Therefore before moving on to another place of the map, better go back where you deployed it and pick it up to avoid waiting. However, it covers a large area and affects both teammates and enemies. There are basically three main ways you can use the X6 infiltration device, firstly you can protect your own teammates, secondly you can disrupt enemies or thirdly you can do both at the same time. With the first option you not only protect all your teammates within its deployment area from being spotted. It's also the fastest and only way to make progress for Blasco's master's level, which currently requires 1200 blocked spots. So try playing a more supportive role by staying close to larger groups of teammates or vehicles you can protect from enemy looks. A one-man army playstyle won't help you here. And by the way when talking about vehicles, the X6 infiltration device also proves its worth, because it prevents allied vehicles in range being locked on by enemy soflum, javelins or other laser-guided weapons. Further the X6 device is less vulnerable when set up indoors since it's harder for Casper's drone to destroy it. By the way, since the Season 4 update Casper's drone is now able to not only disrupt but also destroy enemy equipment, which makes it even more powerful. But even if having such a drone around can be risky, it's also a chance since you could use it to boost the number of blocked spots you make during a round to the moon. Same applies for enemy TUGS nearby. On the other hand, if you set it up outdoors there might be a higher probability of nearby teammates to get spotted due to free line of sight. So you might get to block more spots but keep in mind you're also more vulnerable out there. Just remember when you do so, always place it behind cover to prevent it from getting found or destroyed too easily. Alternatively, you can use the X6 infiltration device to disrupt the enemy team. Like I already mentioned, once deployed it will make all enemy equipment nearby visible on the minimap and through buildings and objects. It somehow like takes ability, just for enemy equipment instead of enemy soldiers. Enemy recon gadgets within range such as the TUGS or proxy sensors also don't work anymore. And more importantly, all enemies within the deployment area of the device are disrupted, making their minimap completely useless. You will be rewarded with 5 XP for each enemy you disrupt, and you can also get 10 XP for disruption assists when disrupted enemies get killed by your teammates. To maximize your chances of assists, pick proxy sensors or TUGS as your gadget of choice. Like this you can make sure all enemies around are basically blind while being visible to your whole kill greedy team. And if you literally want to make them blind, you could also use smoke to your advantage. And that's it for our quick overview over the new specialist and how to get the most out of your gameplay with her. I hope you found this video helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications for more Battlefield 2042 tips and tricks. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the battlefield.